So wait. Yes, sir. The track season is over, right? Come on. Um, welcome back, everybody, by the way. Thank you for joining me. Um, one of the biggest highlights of this year's season was the competition between the women, the rivalries. We saw the Shelly and Fraser, Elaine Thompson, Shakari rivalry. We saw the rivalry between Sharika and um, Christine Mbong over the 200 meters. Um, Shelly and Fraser Price was asked about the media attention and the focus on the rivalry in, with, with the women sprinters, um, especially after the whole Prefontaine thing with Shakari Richardson and all of that, right? All right, so the media caught up with Shelly and Fraser Price, right? Right. And they asked her about probably one of the biggest highlights of the season, the rivalry and the media attention between, um, say, the women sprinters this year. That would include Elaine um, and Shakari. And you can't leave out that rivalry that was developing at the end of the season between Christine Mboma and Sharika Jackson, Sharika. right? Yeah. Um, so the media caught up with Shelly and she commented on how media focused on the rivalry between women sprinters. All right. For me, I'm not going to stand in the shadows. I'm not going to stand at the line and act like I don't want it. I want it as much as you do. So even though I'm, they're pitting us against each other, we're still competitive athletes. We still want to win, but we still have to have mutual respect for each other. You cross the line. That's it, Shelly said. All right. She further added, it's good to have the media being focused on us as women that we are bringing to the table and what we are bringing to the table and how we are showing up and how we are dominating. Okay. All right. Um, what do you take from that? I think, you know, as I always say about Shelley, you know, her true nature as a champion shines through her statements. I mean, that is just um a champion's response yeah i think she is looking it's good that she has the ability to step outside of the situation yeah and analyze it um and i agree with her you know it's only it can only do good it can only drive them to achieve higher heights so yeah you know um the part where she says you cross the line that's it yeah. So like a um you better have manners to some people. Yeah. You know what I mean? Okay. For some people did say she look like look away and all this and all that. Have some respect. You know what I mean? Okay. Yeah, that and that comes from probably being much older. Yeah. The elder stateswoman. You know what I mean? I thought I just thought she was talking know? about crossing the finish line, you know? <laughs> 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 uh, but, but yeah you know what i mean it's, 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 it's definitely a good thing to see the women getting this much attention for sure for sure yeah, and man. it's also a testament to how well they have been doing you know yeah. we don't want to make it sound like um they, they didn't deserve this type of attention you know yeah. credit to them they're they are right now carrying athletics on a whole because yeah, and even though jamaica men the jamaica men team aren't doing well, so great we can't say that about USA too, you know. Is that like they have any really bright stars, you know? Yeah, man. Them have, them have won you to, I think, um, decent that come from the 400 and coming back. No, 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 decent the, for sure. Trevor but... Brummel was the favorite, but he disappointed um, in the Olympics. But that's but the that point even more. There's yeah, nobody they're like not as really. Dominant. They're not exactly. as dominant either. Exactly. Exactly. They're not as dominant. It's the women. I, and it goes across the board. I mean, Mm. shout out to Mboma too you know what I mean yeah. you know so it yeah. just really goes to show that there, there's a shift yeah man you definitely know, right now yeah right. because when you look back at it right the season ended with the second and third fastest women's 100 meters in history right Lane, you know what I mean and um, Shelly um, for sure second and third in history respectively so Definitely um, a record shattering season. Probably one of the most um, competitive um, track and field seasons we've seen. For women, and that for is sure. largely down to Shelly um, and Elaine. You're the new one, Shelly. 
Slim. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, man. So, yeah. Definitely. I definitely. I feel what you're saying there, there um, Lady Fraser Price. Mommy Rocket. All right. Um, so, we're going to end it there. So, wait. Thanks, right. everybody, for um, tuning into this one. Thank you for joining me, Wade. And remember, like and subscribe, guys. Thank you for supporting yeah, the man. channel.